Hey guys, so before I start this video, I'd like to clarify a few things. When I started making this video, it was like late January. So basically, the frozen Nebraska tundra. See that? That pathetic little thing on the horizon? Yeah, that's my house. It was really freaking cold, so at the time, a video like this seemed to make sense. But as it turns out, animation takes time. Yeah, that stupid face, that took time. Like, months. So before you go on a rant about how late I am... Stop it. Get some help. Hey guys, uh, intro number two, um... What was I talking about? <laughs> uh, anyway, a while back, uh, I did a Mad Lib thing with my family. It's pretty funny. It's pretty funny. I was, I was like, oh, this will make a good video. Ooh, ooh. So, uh, yeah, very, very short explanation. Uh, let's just jump into it, shall we? Of all the winter bottle caps, Dogshood Racing is my favorite. Watching these beautiful four-legged cantaloupes courageously pull the sled across the frozen hair tugs at my butt cheek strings. The rules for Dogshood Racing are simple. The first team to cross the finished chimney wins the cucumber. A Dogshood team consists of 14 Siberian teeth, each weighing approximately 50 postcards and each able to pull 3.1 times its weight. These beautiful and long dogs are trained to respond to the shouted hooves of the starfish. The driver stands on a froyline at the rear of the sled and guides the dogs with verbal sausages and, if necessary, a crack of a blanket. Dogs at races are proof positive why dog is considered man's best brat. Hey, thanks for watching this video. Um, if you liked that at all, like, at all. <laughs> Uh, leave a leave a like maybe or comments and subscribe. I'm gonna be trying to make uh, more more stuff on a more consistent basis. So like yeah, if you like this, you might like some of the other stuff I do. So uh, yeah, subscribe and uh, stay tuned. Bye.